morning and welcome to Going to Work with Gina, which is the inspiration for STEM students. I am Dr. Gina Henderson. STEM students, this morning we want to discuss, um, we're still discussing the acronym STEM, and today we are actually on the engineering discipline, which is the E in STEM, okay? And so, what is an engineer? Well, an engineer is one who design well they design um build test fabricate manufacture um devices machines um technologies they do a whole uh, conglomerate of, of of things a lot of things that you see in this world have been engineered what makes an engineer um Oh, let's see, what skill set does an engineer add to the acronym discipline? I can tell you, um, they add a lot of science. Uh, remember, I am a transformed engineer, um, having my first degree as a mathematician. So, a lot of the things that I had to do in order to be transformed into an engineer included, like, um, understanding dynamics and statics and thermodynamics and fluid dynamics and heat transfer so uh, physics um, chemistry there's a lot more um, science actually put behind the engineering degree so engineers do take all of the math courses that a mathematician has to take but they have that added feature of science because they have to understand Newton's um, third law and second law of motion um, all of those different Newton laws, they, they have to understand that. And so, um, when, what, I, what I feel that engineering has added to my skill set that I have is that engineering, um, they have taught me how to, how to apply uh, my math skills. So, um, engineering for me is more of a platform where I get to apply my knowledge. So, all of the knowledge that I've gained, I get to apply it to learn how to improve things or to learn how to do things faster, better, cheaper um, when working here at the Kennedy Space Center. Learning how to um, um, understand different components and, and how that component integrates into a larger system and how that system basically ends, in, ends up as being a spacecraft which actually gets launched. So those are some of the things that engineers do um, when you think about the engineers here at the Kennedy Space Center. And so, like I said, there's all types of engineers. There's aerospace engineers, reliability engineers, quality engineers, safety engineers. Um, there's chemical engineers, biomechanical engineers. There are electrical engineers. There are mechanical engineers. There are industrial engineers. So there's all type of engineers. So, and they all have the same um, skill set. And what makes them um, differentiate themselves from the others is the course uh, they're taking um, the more specialized knowledge that that curriculum may have. But they all um, do have computer programming um, at some aspect into their knowledge, okay? So I wanna thank you for going to work with Gina this morning. And as we continue to understand the STEM acronym, um, you will understand what are some of the attributes and characteristics that an engineer or a STEM professional hold. So I want to thank you for going to work with Gina. If there's any commercials that you've missed, please don't hesitate to go to YouTube, going to work with Gina. Thank you.